Don't go anywhere, Ridge. <laughs> You're not finished yet. Ridge wrote a song a while back, and I'll let him tell the, the story. You'll know which one I'm talking about here in a second. I'll let him tell the story, but he was at my house a few months ago, and he said, oh, I want to play something for you. And it was early in the morning, and I was getting ready to go to the office and have a nice day, and Ridge puts this song in, and I listened to it, and I said, boy, Ridge, thanks a lot. <laughs> You'll know what I mean in a minute, but it kind of brought me down at first, and then as I thought about this song, as the day went on, I realized it really didn't bring me down. It did exactly the opposite. It took me a while to think about it. I'm not inviting you to... Uh, in the evening on a downer, I'm hoping that these people will get it a lot quicker than I did. <laughs> so the thing about this song is when he, when he played it for me, he said, well, I'm never going to play this in concert because I was able to go into the studio right after he wrote it. I was able to go into the studio and record it. And I, got, I told the guy, hey, roll on this because I probably can only do this once. So he recorded it. A couple of months ago in Dallas, I did persuade Ridge to perform this tune one other time. So you'll do it again tonight, I presume. <laughs> Tell them the story first so they'll understand, and then... Um, I feel like Davy Crockett and y'all are sitting in his army, and I... <laughs> I better play it now, Ridge. I will do this one, and then I'm honor-bound to do another one afterwards. So. <laughs> Trade you. I had a, a dear friend named Margaret. Margaret Coffey. And Margaret, what, what a special spirit. What a lovely, lovely lady she was. Tall and willowy and beautiful and well-spoken and not the least bit judgmental and, and just an angel. And she lived on a beautiful ranch in Camp Verde, Texas. And as was her custom, she would walk her dogs through the, her, some fields at her ranch, and I don't know the proper ranching terminology, but she was walking her dogs, um, and her dogs evidently um, came upon a, a newborn calf, and the mother calf protected her baby, and Margaret was killed. And so I, uh, I uh, heard the news, and, and this is what came of it. And she could show me wisdom and beauty in her own funny style. She called me a king. She made me smell roses on days when I could not manage a smile. She'd say, this day is special. This day is lovely. Oh, how we need it, come on outside. Life's for the taking, know that you're cared for. Know that I love you, this day is ours. And sure she find me down and disheartened, wounded and lost, adrift on the tide. She'd take my hand and tell me a story. Soon she worked wonders, restoring my pride. She'd say, this one is special, this one is lovely. God, when he's lonely, stay by his side. Life's for the taking, know that you cared for. Know that I love you, this one is ours.
If I could speak to God the Father and tell him about this friend of mine, I'd pray the Lord to watch o'er and guide her. But above all of that, please keep this in mind. This one was special. This one was lovely. God, how I need her here by my side. If you must take her, know that she's cared for. Know that she's loved. For this one was mine. If you must take her, tell her I love her. Tell her she's cared for, for this one was mine.